Oh, so I can you know, here show you the the Rainbow Wonderland uh, coloring here, and uh, what I'm going to be working with is I'm going to be working with the the light pink marker, and uh, you know light pink marker only here. <laughs> but uh, what I'm going to go ahead and do is um, is uh, you know I went ahead and uh, you know, add a, a cloud right here, but what I went ahead and do is I added a, like a tulip looking flower, and then the you know, the sun the sunset you know, the sun and then the rainbow and then that a leaf and then that see so that cloud right here but but what I'm gonna go ahead and do is uh, draw uh, draw a cloud a few clouds you know I guess they don't have to be big and draw um, another cloud right here you know, make them a little smaller but um, see here you know, said so make them a little smaller like uh, you know if they were like uh, you know far-sighted Where if they were, you know, pretty in long distance away, and uh, you know, you you would think that you know, you know, why would you spend a, a whole lot of time, you know, just drawing clouds or whatever? But you know, it's possible. It's like, like in you, know, if you were to draw a cloud, that you know, that, that you would, um, you know, you would be able to kind of experiment around a little bit with the different colors and maybe the the types of arts and stuff like that, you know, the creativity that you can come up with whenever you draw a cloud. But, uh, see here, you got a cloud right there, and then, of course, uh, you know, leaf and stuff like a flower, and a leaf would probably be in, like, a flower bed or a flower pot or something like that, but, but, um, you know, of course, uh, you know, um, uh, oh, you know, the, the artwork that I'm working on is more like, uh, you know, like, you know, use your imagination, you know, that type of that type of art but right here I went and drew a rainbow and uh, went ahead and, went and put a cloud right here if you see is that I've already got two clouds right here I went ahead and colored them in with orange and then the blue marker but what I'm gonna go ahead and do is with the same uh, the same color go ahead and add uh, just a little bit of a pink you know to the inside of, uh, of the cloud you kind of give it that you know that rainbow that rainbow type of type color, and uh, you know, make it uh, you know, give it like a little puffy, puffy type of type look. Just kind of, just kind of lightly uh, put a few few marks of a pink right in there. Yeah, which I would I would probably say to go ahead and start on the edges first. Is to uh, start on the edges. And uh, work your way towards the inside. But um, go ahead and uh, see. I guess you guess you could do either way. You know, start from the the edges or start in the center. But uh, kind of give it that uh, that real puffy, cloudy type of, type look on it. And then uh, go ahead and add a little bit of a few uh, line blends. Uh, few lines of pink in the center there and then go ahead and get these uh, get these ones right here but with these clouds right here which I guess I'll go ahead and add a, another cloud right here but you know if you you draw like a, a number of these clouds and um, and uh, you, know, you, know, you know I mean you just begin to wonder you know like and if you if you uh, were to draw a cloud, and uh, you know maybe it, it, it may not look that great or whatever, or you know, I don't know, maybe it could be you know thunder clouds or something like that, thunder clouds. But this is like you know what you call a you know something that that you're just kind of a you're just kind of being creative about, like you know changing the color of them. Like and I don't know, you know, I, maybe every once in a while, maybe I've seen a, a pink cloud before, or I've seen, I've seen maybe a green-looking cloud, but uh, you know, maybe a green cloud, or or maybe a purple cloud every once in a while. But I guess they have their standard type colors. But um, see here, finish the, this cloud up right here, and then after that, and then go.
go ahead and add it. Go ahead and color a little bit of this cloud in here. But uh, to make it look a little bit like, you know, far distance, which I went ahead and do with this cloud, is I went ahead and put a little bit of green. But, you know, with, with the pink, since I'm uh, only using pink here, that uh, lightly, you know, not a whole lot, but just lightly, lightly colored um, the cloud in with um, just a little bit of pink. Yeah, not a whole lot, but just just enough to kind of to kind of make it look like a, like you know like the sky, I guess you could say. And then I'll leave a little bit of a whiteness in there. But got that right there. Go ahead and color in a little bit of that, and then go ahead and get a little bit more of this cloud here. And got that, got that cloud right there. And then I go ahead and you know, color in a little bit of these, these clouds here. And then I don't know, maybe you could maybe put some seagulls or whatever in the, you know, in this picture. But uh, if I were to put uh, put one a flying seagull or something like that, some type of bird in the sky, then I would maybe say using the pink marker is uh, maybe go ahead and and draw one up but right here give it a you know give it some wings and draw one at about right here and I got you know got a seagull right there and then put you know put the the feet you know down down right in there as you can see Got the, the seagull, and then I got the, the feet right there, and then a the seagull, and then after that, and then uh, you know along here with the flower, go ahead and color in a little bit of these white spots right here with a little bit of the flower, you know, a tulip. I guess most people call them tulips, but uh, the kind that the kind that changes color. <laughs> anyway. But anyway, you got you got the clouds. You got you got the, most of the clouds here. Go and get this one a little bit colored in, and go and get that one colored in. And they are. It's like in the uh, what you call it is a, the the rainbow wonderland. You know, coloring.